Welcome to MoCo, the online community for mobile minds. My name is Charlotte Bostrom. So measuring the effects of your campaign is crucial in our marketing. But still, there is one sector lagging behind, the mobile ad space. So Stephanie, why is it so hard to measure? Mobile is very hard uh, to measure for a number of reasons. Obviously, it has grown uh, rapidly these uh, past few years. One reason is the walled gardens of Apple and Google, so the Google Play Store and the Apple Store. In addition to that, also the fragmentation of uh, devices. I know that you're trying to develop a way to measure it across devices, right? That is correct, because for us, marketing is uh, holistic, so we're looking at the entire customer journey. So mobile underpins all of it, so it can amplify TV, it can amplify out of home, and uh, essentially allow us to track the entire customer journey. So having that one customer view is really, really important from a marketing perspective, and we need technology to be able to do that. This measuring you're talking about, also called attribution. What is it exactly you want to measure? I mean, we live in a digital age, so theoretically we should be able to track almost everything, or at least that is our expectation. But I think it's important to always keep that balance between analyzing, measuring absolutely everything, and then the syndrome we call paralysis by analysis. So use some common sense uh, from time to time as well. We're all gathering more and more data, and so do you in your work. Considering this development, in three years, how do you think mobile advertising will have changed? I think uh, mobile advertising is changing rapidly. So I think we're going very much towards a data-driven approach and that will then allow us to provide, let's say, a very personalized uh, message to clients. Actually, brands will be able to have conversations with their target audience rather than pushing a message out to them. So we, our ultimate goal is to have personalization at scale and make the ad as relevant as possible to, to the target audience. Could you give a concrete example there? Yeah, I think what we've done, I mean, we always try to innovate in, in this space. So what we did uh, fairly recently is that uh, we used uh, weather data and based on that weather feed, we would show from one of our clients, a, a very uh, well-known retailer in the UK, we would actually show uh, different products depending on the weather. So create that relevance in the, in the mobile moment, uh, so, uh, so to speak. So the client is called very.co.uk and is essentially uh, a massive brand, the second largest pure play e-commerce player in the UK after Amazon. Thank you so much, Stephanie, for being here and good luck in your projects. Thank you. If you want more of this, we have daily updates on our social channels, our YouTube channel and our website, of course. See you there.